Hello, how are you guys doing? So yeah, as promised, I did tell you guys I was gonna make a, I was gonna make a, a remake, not a remake, but I was gonna make like a video tutorial showing you guys how to do hi hats like problem child and and thing and my new kind of kind of hi hats. So well, you're gonna have to excuse me. I kind of went a bit wild. I already I did I did the hi hats. The thing is, what I was doing it was gonna take too long if I was gonna record it. So what I did is I just did everything. I did basically I did a basic beat of how a typical uh problem child beat would be like and then another I added an, an extra beat to it and I added uh beats by a, a typical beat by heavy K, how would it be like and then I, I did the high the hi hat manu. So I'll I'll let you guys listen to the hi hat manu and then I'll also I'll play the, the typical thing. The typical um what's this guy? Problem child's hi hat. Yeah. So let me just quickly try and get a, a manual track so you can so you guys can compare so you guys can hear what which which hi hats I'm talking about when I'm talking about the manual hi hat. So it's somewhere here. Uh yeah. Okay, cool. That's somewhere there. Yeah, and it's there. Hang on there. Okay, cool. This type of hi hat here. Yeah. It's like tick 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 You're gonna hear it when the when the intro track. There it is, you can already hear it there. So that's a typical Manu hi-hat. The track is called Manu, I thought it's quite an old track. So let's go here. So I made my track here. I would explain everything, but it's not that bad. It's not, it's not that complex. So I'll just show you what I did. Basically, I laid down this hi-hat here. One, two, three, four of them. One, two, three, four again. Then I went to one and I did a snap, which is one. See? And then I did this. You gonna identify each sound and then basically this I repeated. I repeated, I put I put a shake as part of it, just to make it more realistic. And this is just an extra sound to make it yeah more realistic as well. So overall it sounds like this. So if you wanted to add your own kick, you could. So that's how I did mine. Let's go back here again. And again. I think I'm missing something. Okay, cool. Let me just do this quick for you guys. So, yeah. I think this is what I'm missing, so I'll just do this. Because if you listen carefully, you hear that there's there's a hard clap at the end like that. So listen carefully, like listen to me some more. See, so I'm trying to get that as well. Okay, it doesn't work well, but anyway. So yeah, that was the Manu, that was the Manu hi hat. So now let's go to the problem child one. Problem child, unfortunately, I don't have a good track. I've got too many problem child tracks, so I don't know which one would work best for you guys. You can actually hear the type of hi hat that it does. But um I'll try to find you guys like a good track by problem child where you can actually hear the hi hat that I'm talking about when I say problem child hi hat. So let's just quickly go down quick, 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 quick. Uh, but it's like t -t -t And it's usually like very very low it's in the background but it's what gives prom child is unique it's what it basically what makes prom child who he is and it gives the track the fast pace like that fast pace going typical prom child track if you've heard prom child track you would know so let me try this one more
Okay, unfortunately, none of them have it. But as you can hear, basically, Prime Chat has a hectic hi hat going on. So, what I'll do, I'll play you guys all the hi hat stuff that I think is there. And then I'll start adding extra sounds, which I've already added. But I'll, I'll add these extra sounds for you guys so you can identify and actually hear that this extra sounds in the Prime Chat track with, with, with the hi hats as well. So, the hi hats will be something like this. So, it'll be like this. So that will be the hi hat, and then let's see. I start adding extra sounds. <clears throat> no, sorry, sorry. I'm gonna add sounds that Prom Child would typically add something like this. Already you can tell it's got that it's got that prom child vibe to it. So you know prom child, he always had that sick bass going on. So I did my own little bass, yeah. So that right there for me would be a typical prom child track like basically the main key elements you have the strings there you've got the bass line and you've got these type of deep chord sounds like that you know and then yeah usually he puts these type of sounds in a break where it's gonna it's gonna make like a pretty long break maybe 30 second break and it's gonna put in these deep sounds and some extra pads in the background and then overall yeah so this would be my thing this here is me it's my attempt of thing of heavy case type of beat so you know this wasn't part of the tutorial so i'm just gonna play this straight away i'm not gonna compare it to anything so yeah okay let me just play you guys a typical heavy case beat so let me see so you so you know okay let's try it so so that's a typical heavy case beat you know that so let's go to this one here and let's do the same thing Knowing heavy K, you know heavy K usually has that that hectic bass, that long bass that goes in for sometimes. So it's something I don't design here. somewhere along those lines here but usually it's a very creative bass so i don't have time so i just cut it off there but that's how i did it the main key things would be your kick obviously you need a sound like this you need something like you need those type of sounds here those type of sounds you usually push them up at the same time with the kick so that's why you get that heavy kick kind of type of kick like this and then obviously in the background there's a constantly going um shake kind of this so that's how I did my typical um, prom child beat and uh, hi hats, prom child hi hats and my new hi hats and beats and have K beats as well. Hope you guys like that. Um, I'll try to do others as well if I can. So long as time prevails, otherwise, uh, so long as there's still time and I can think of something else that I can do, who, who I can identify as unique for you guys, and I can do a thing to that type of beats for you guys. Uh, Uhuru, uh, Uhuru is a bit hard, but I'll try. I'll try some of them. I'll see if I can do it. But anyway, that's how I did those things there, guys. Hope you like the tutorial. Subscribe, like, comment, shut.